hi guys welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna make some Jamaican steamed fish with okra but guys I'm gonna cook my fish in my oven okay instead of doing it on the stove I'm gonna bake it in the oven so here I have two red brim you can use whatever fish you have that already washed and clean in some lemon juice okay and these are pretty big these are all of my fresh herbs here I have at least one tablespoon of fresh thyme. I also have half of carrot, one onion that I cut. I cut everything already, guys, okay? Just to make the video more shorter. And I also have one tomato, three cloves of garlic, some scallion, and pimento seed, okay? And a scotch bonnet pepper. I'm using at least one teaspoon of my pimento seed okay but i'll list everything below and how much i'm using yeah and my okra and i'm using at least 10 to 11 okra that i wash and cut yeah so these are all of my seasoning here I have one teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning, one teaspoon of fish seasoning, one teaspoon of black pepper, and at least half teaspoon of salt, okay? I'm only gonna use a small amount of seasoning because you don't need a lot. Because all those fresh herbs, guys, is gonna make your fish be super, super delicious. So you don't need to add a lot of seasoning. This is perfect. So I'm gonna firstly add some olive oil to my fish just to keep it nice and nice and you want to try and rub it in turn it over yeah so i'm gonna blend all my seasoning together so everything will all combine I'm not gonna use all my seasoning at once guys just continue to watch the video and you see exactly what I'm gonna do with the rest okay yeah I'm gonna sprinkle the my seasoning on my fish like so and guys if you want you can always cut your fish but I'm not gonna do that today I'm just gonna cook it as it is yeah I'm going to turn it over. So I leave this amount of seasoning. You want to take this seasoning and put on the inside of your fish. And you want to rub it in, okay? I love steam fish and it's so healthy make sure that the fish is nicely coated with the seasoning so that's done so here I have my baking tray and I'm gonna use the glass one you can use whichever one you have, okay? So I'm going to add some olive oil to it. And I'm going to add at least two teaspoons of my olive oil. Then I'm going to take my brush. And you want to just brush it all over. Then I'm going to firstly add some of my onions. My tomato, some scotch bonnet pepper. You can just add to your liking. It all depends how spicy you want it to be. Some scallion and some carrot. 
I'm gonna give it a mix. I'm gonna add some salt, just a pinch of salt, small amount of black pepper. I'm gonna also add some of my fresh thyme. And I'm gonna add at least one cup of hot water. Add all my remaining seasoning. Give it a stir. So now I'm gonna add my fish. And you just wanna lay it down. So now that I had my fish, I'm going to add all my remaining herbs, tomato, everything that leave back. And you just want to put it right on top of your fish, okay? The pimento seed, just add it all. Fresh thyme. So guys, this is totally optional, but I'm just going to add at least one small potato to it. And it's just going to thicken up your gravy a bit, okay? Yes. As you can see, I cut it like so. Some butter. One spoon of butter. Just add it on top of your fish, it doesn't matter. And guys, I'm just gonna add the okra now, okay? Just add it all over in your baking pan, like so. I'm going to add some of my cracked black pepper. Look at it guys. I'm going to soon put it in my oven. It looks so, so, so good. cover it up with my file paper and I'm gonna put it in my oven guys for at least 25 to 30 minutes okay yes and 160 degree Celsius So in the oven it goes stay tuned so guys I just removed my fish from my oven it's been in the oven for at least 25 minutes okay so now I'm gonna remove the cover look at that it looks super super yummy but guys it is not yet finished I'm gonna put it back in my oven okay It looks good. You can just pour all that liquid on top of the fish. I'm gonna put it back in my oven, guys, for at least 15 minutes, and it is ready. 15 to 20 minutes, okay? gonna put it on 200 
degree Celsius, okay? It is all finished and this is what it looks like. Oh my goodness, it looks super, super delicious. You could see all the steam coming from the fish, the okra, the potato, the carrot, everything is all finished. I'm telling you, this right here guys is a must try. It looks absolutely delicious. So, so good. So I'm just gonna take my fork and just cut into my fish and as you can see guys it is so so nice nicely nicely done I'm telling you this recipe right here is a must try guys please don't forget to share this video to your families to your friends and everyone on your social media I will really really appreciate it and if you're not yet subscribed to my youtube channel Please subscribe so you can receive more delicious videos like these and hit your notification button for whenever I upload a video you will be the first to see it okay thank you all so much for watching this video until next time bye don't forget to keep laughing keep smiling no matter what because God is always on your side bye guys much love look at that so so good